Liz Truss would be a disaster. But I hadn't banked on her being a catastrophe. I mean, an hour before Kwatang was 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 sacked, and he was sacked, he didn't resign, didn't do it his own volition. Uh, number ten was putting out. She has complete and utter confidence in him, and there won't be a, there won't be a, a a press conference. And then the press conference was just terrible. Um, it's interesting listening to Nile Gardner saying the wet. It's got nothing to do with the wet. I mean, one thing that uh, has done is completely united the party. She will be gone, I suspect, by Sunday, if not um, certainly by by Wednesday, because the markets will, will just kill her. As Margaret Thatcher said many times, you can't buck the markets, and the markets are not happy. The pound is still in a parlous state. And Jeremy Hunt, well, really, it doesn't matter because it was her budget. How many times did we hear her say, we are in lockstep, Kwesi Kwarteng and myself? So she Anna sacrificed Anna her friend, and that's it. Uh, yes, indeed. Uh, Jerry Hayes, um, do you honestly think that Liz Truss is days away from ceasing to be prime minister? Is it that dramatic? Oh, it's that bad. Oh, it's that bad. The cabinet don't support her. And there are one or two people who sort of come out and come on the airways. But who is going to do the Sunday morning slot? Be interesting to see which poor devil is going to be wheeled out. Um, the country has lost the Tory voters have lost confidence. Uh, 64% of people who voted Tory at last election say she should go. And those are the people we've got to listen to. Um, there is a move afoot, whether it's going to work or not, I don't know, but I think it might, uh, that Penny Mordaunt and Rishi Sunak will take over. But the economy is in a parlous state. People's pensions are going down. Today, the Bank of England says we can't prop up pensions anymore. They've stopped uh, selling, um, or rather buying, buying gilts. The, the economy has been crashed, and a penalty has to be paid if the Tories have any chance of winning the next uh, election. Jerry it's Hayes, terrible, I, I completely accept your... Terrible. I accept your analysis. Um, however, Liz Truss only goes if the party can unite around one candidate and no such candidate exists. I'm not sure that's right. Uh, the the, the, the mordant Sunak, and I mean, I don't know whether Sunak is pre pre prepared to do it, uh, seems to be gaining some traction at the moment. And there has to be a coronation. There cannot be a seven-week or even a two-week leadership campaign because the markets will just kill us and we'll be even more trouble. Fact is, this is a, a failed economic policy. You know, the aspirations, I agree with all the aspirations, but this is not the right time to do it. And the economy has tanked. You said but a Jerry, moment ago in your introduction. Jerry, yep. Jerry, um, the... the uh, Trust supporters and the Boris wing of the party absolutely detest Rishi Sunak. They consider him a snake in the grass and the man who engineered Boris Johnson's exit from number 10. No, he didn't, actually. I mean, Boris Johnson self-binned. Uh, that's, that's what happened. Boris was his own worst enemy. Uh, but, you know, he's, his history, he's not going to come back. And it's, it's rather wishful thinking to say that he will. He's not, he's not going to come back. If the Tories have got any chance at all, trust has got to be ditched. Ditch, she's going to be ditched to save the economy, let alone the government. It's um, a terrible only a few situation. Seconds. Uh, Jerry, only a few seconds to go, but you are a broadcasting professional. Uh, we know that. Um, but do you think uh, logistically it's possible for Liz Trust to be dispatched in the next few days. Would she need to resign? What is the mechanism? What will happen is there are lots of uh, letters going into the 1922 committee. By now, her position is untenable. She would have probably been told this and she'll sort of say, she'll be told, look, you've got to go for the unity of the party. If you stick there, we will get rid of you. 1922 committee will change the rules. Won't go to the party membership. A lot of them will get upset. Well, tough, they chose her. <laughs> you know, they made the bed, they're going to line it. And the fact is, we have got to have a coronation of some sort. We've got to get this economy together. And we don't want a Labour government. 